Hello and welcome to SimLab Composer 2015 training series. In this tutorial we will quickly get a brief on how to open and edit for a 3D PDF output, different settings and so on. Having that said, let's get started. When creating a 3D PDF file through Composer, we will be needing a model. So I will select one of the recent files over here. Select the ring project. Feel free to use your own models, out of the abundant formats supported by Composer. Anyways, before starting we will get rid of the animation and scene states that came with this project. First go to the animation workbench. These are keys for the animation in this project. Hit this little icon over here to get rid of all animation keys in the entire scene. Now we will go to the scene state task to delete the states. Those are the scene states thumbnails. Now that we are done with that let's go ahead and drag materials. We want to create a material scene state. Go to Materials Task tab and drag Drop out of the library. Hit F4 to render preview. You can also do that through the rendering workbench. Okay, now that we have our material all set we need to edit the scene states filter, so we will only state materials. A little note on selecting, hold control and select to apply scene states on selection only, but this model is too broken that it may take an effort to do, so it's faster to select through materials. Let's open the scene materials panel. Click on any slot then hit the Select Through Materials icon. As we can see everything that fall under this material is selected, and it's acting as a single body. Anyways now, let's uncheck the scene states filters which we don't need. Just leave the material filter checked then hit the capture icon. Notice a thumbnail popping in the library below. Now let's change the materials and apply the same procedures. Notice the small drop-down arrow here. Here is where we can switch between stating from selection or from entire scene. We don't need from selection for materials but we will be using it for the hide and show, which we will get into in a while. Okay, so in order to create the hide and show states, we first must select the part we want to hide and show, then switch to selection only. Oops, we forgot to change the filters to hide and show. Now let's state a state of hidden and a state of shown.
All that is left if to select a template and export, go to Sharing Workbench and hit the settings under the PDF task. Select this one over here. The tabs up here are different settings for our output, right now we will just go with the defaults. Now that we are done with stating. However we will add a URL link in our template, so let's go ahead and hit the edit button here, hit the text icon. Let's say, click to go to website. Add URL from the type drop-down menu and paste a URL. Now we are done for, we don't want to edit the original template, so let's save this template on the desktop for now. Now we should trace it so it will show in this templates list. Hit export and we have created our first PDF. You'll be asked to choose which scene state you want to include, in this case we want them all. Now we can navigate our 3D PDF. This is all for this tutorial, thanks for watching, hope to see you soon, goodbye.